Hi, I'm Junior from One Eye Doll. Uh, typically, I play drums in a band One Eye Doll, um, but today I'm going to show you one of my very favorite things uh, in the universe, which is the Arp Odyssey. Um, the Arp Odyssey is featured on a lot of One Eye Doll songs, actually, um, including our uh, cover of I'm a Viking. If you've heard uh, any of the like crazy Ingbe Malmsteen solos, um, that was done on an Arp Odyssey, and it's also on our new album called Witches, on a song, it's, it's all over the album, but one of the songs that it's really featured on is called Afflicted. Uh, we have a video for that coming out soon. Um, and uh, I, uh, the main riff in that song is basically just one note, and it goes kind of like this. And um, I did it on an ARP Odyssey. All right, so uh, I'm just gonna kind of go over the basics of how to make the, the sound on the song Afflicted. This is a bass sound, so we're, we're talking about, you know, the lower octaves, I have the two octaves down. We're gonna do a, a basic kind of a gate uh, on the envelope. So this is gonna be no attack, no decay, the sustain all the way up, and no release. So, so this is a, an E, I'm just using this little tuner here to make sure that I'm in tune. There you go. So I'm gonna have I'm gonna have the first oscillator in tune. I'm gonna detune the next oscillator just a little bit, and then I'll blend them together. for a really kind of huge fat tone. Something that the ARP Odyssey does that a lot of other synths don't uh, incorporate is a really interesting sample and hold section. And what that does is uh, it allows you to sample different waveforms, like a sawtooth waveform, a square from either VCO1 or VCO2, or the noise generator. The noise generator is gonna give you a random value. Basically what this is doing is it's gonna choose a random value for the frequency of the filter. So I have the, uh, the resonance all the way up. You, you might recognize this from like Doctor Who used a, an, an ARP Odyssey on a lot of their soundtracks. They would uh, get this kind of uh, random, quirky computer sound. And you can hear that the sample and hold generator is, is choosing a random frequency every time I hit the note. What's cool about the new ARP Odyssey from Korg is that it has distortion built in. So even if you don't have a, a tube amp to pl plug it into, you can kind of still get this sound. And I've added, actually added it onto this sound here so you can get a feel of what it sounds like with it and without it. And then without it. Kind of a more typical sound, but that's pretty much it. I'm not using any of the uh, the frequency modulation. This is kind of vibrato. Um, I, the, the tone only has one note, so I don't need to use portamento. Um, and uh, it's a really basic, simple tone that is just huge sounding on the album and uh, really easy to dial in.